Hello YouTube, it is Chris here and in today's episode we're going to be taking a look at the gear only box by Survival Boxes. So stick with me. Welcome back everybody and thank you for sticking with me. Like I said, today we're going to be taking a look at the gear only box for March, which is land navigation by Survival Boxes. Now as most of my viewers know, you guys do know that I do like Survival Boxes because they try to be a well-rounded service, especially with the different services they offer. They offer the Alpha Box, which is more of a food, water, and some survival gear supplement box. And they have the Bravo Box, which is more geared around food and sustenance and seeds things like that and, and then they have the gear only box for the people who love gear porn now one of my favorite things about survival boxes are their survival knowledge cards and for this month they have card number 14 which is for land navigation and map reading basics now I went ahead and put it into my notebook that I got from my welcome box but I basically collect all the survival knowledge cards and have some fun reference points that I can use to teach my kids and family some nice little tips and tricks while we're doing some outdoor tasks First item in the gear only box is the UST Lensatic Compass. Now this one's not too bad actually, it does work, I have checked it, and I like the fact that it's got the little magnifying lens so you can actually check, put this up to your eye and go check the map and make sure the waypoint that you're pointing to and know the direction of your travel and everything like that. It's really really good, however this is made of plastic so I wouldn't keep this as a very very durable compass, but they only give it like a $5.99 value so that's not too bad in my book. The next item on the gear box is the Humvee 12 by 25 binoculars. Now for you guys who don't know what those numbers mean is the first number is the magnification level and then that is the number in millimeters of the ocular that allow the viewfinder that lets you see through the binoculars. So this is 12 magnification by 25 millimeter viewfinder. Now these have ruby red lenses which are kind of nice actually um, for a cheaper binocular set but we went ahead and took these bad boys outside and gave them a run and we found that we could see our kids through our viewfinder on our phone with the um, binocular rig that we have see pretty well actually it wasn't too bad it is better than some of the cheaper ones but with this only having a $17.98 value I can't really fault it for its lack of high definition the next item in the box is this topographical map symbols and map reading cards from Essie which is actually pretty cool they have a lot of good map reading tools here with some protractor information and what we really love about this is the fact that it gives you some really cool universal symbols to help you read and understand a topographical map while you're learning the next item is this base plate compass which is not too bad actually because you can use this one for the map reading while you're trying to figure out where you're supposed to go and then use the lensatic compass as your step-by-step -step operational guide to make sure you're heading in the right direction. The next item is the FM or Field Manual 21-26 Map Reading Land Navigation by the Department of the Army, which is an older issue, but a lot of civilians use it as a reference guide to learn how to meet, read maps and learn some navigation, basic navigation. And uh, we get this in a lot of different kits, but this is still a really good, valuable piece of information. Now, they have this valued at a $7.98 value, and we were able to find it for $10.75, so we found it for more expensive on Amazon than what they have it listed. Next item is this Moonlit Micro LED Lantern by Night Eyes, and this is pretty freaking sweet. This is a 360 degree lamp which is pretty freaking awesome but what I like about it it is it is water resistant this would do a really good job giving some low light map reading or some book reading instead of a tent so you're not disturbing others while they're sleeping but the great thing about that is it's supposed to last for about 60 hours which is pretty darn intense now with some of the footage you're gonna see that I'm doing with my kids and let them try it out while they're reading um, it's hard to pick up on camera but they said they didn't have a problem while they're trying to read their books when I let them have like a little bunk bed camp tent Next item is a map protractor, which is a really good handy tool, especially when you're trying to use a graphite pencil or something like that to actually use your topographical map of your local area and actually figure out the waypoints and where you need to go. Always a useful tool. The next item up is the Ultimate Survival Technologies Rain Poncho, and we love this thing because if you're in wet or rainy conditions, the term we like to use is cotton kills. So if you have cotton clothing on, which is what most clothing is made out of, 
having something like this to keep you dry in an emergency is just as important as a emergency survival blanket. So having one of these in your kit, not a bad idea. The next item up is this Soul or Survive Outdoors Longer two-person extra large emergency bivvy. Now we like bivvies and emergency blankets because this folds up as a emergency sleeping bag for two people, which is really, really important. And why these things, these bivvies are so awesome is the fact that, look at it, they freaking super compact in size. It is tape sealed. But the beautiful thing about that is if you're in an absolute crappy situation, the fact that it is windproof and waterproof and it reflects your body heat back onto the person inside can help save your life until you can get to shelter. That's not something I would camp with, but as an emergency piece of equipment and like a bug out bag, it's absolutely perfect. The last item on this list is a pretty sweet item. This is the CRKT Copacetic, which is a flipper design knife. It has sports a liner lock. We love flipper designs because they usually provide a good guard and hand grip. This is no different. This is really ergonomic and comfortable. This has a really hard but kind of decently gentle like elastomer kind of feel to it, mostly in the middle section. And it's got a decently sharp blade. Um, this reminds me more of kind of like a sheep's foot design. However, uh, CRKT does call that a Tonto, so we'll just kind of leave it at that. It is hollow grind. It's actually not too bad at all. We kind of like this. There's no blade play on this thing at all. Deep carry pocket clip. It's a pretty freaking sweet knife. It doesn't look like, yeah, there's only one way to carry this, which is on the right hand side, tip down only. So that is kind of a downside. However, they have this listed at a $44.94 value, but you can find this bad boy on Amazon for about $24.95. Nice lightweight EDC folder. We actually like the fact they included in this box. Now when it's all said and done, this is the gear only box for March 2017 by Survival Boxes, which is their land navigation theme. I think they hit the nail on the head as far as land navigation stuff. Now they have this entire box rated at a $138.20 value versus the $89.99 that you pay for per month for the gear only box. And once we did our street value look up through Amazon, we were able to find a listing of absolutely everything for a total of $112.95, which is still a decent value over what you get because they only had it at $138 value. So you still are saving about $20 to $25 in total once everything is in the cart and you include for taxes and shipping and whatnot. And yes, we do have Amazon Prime, so we're able to count for the free shipping for anybody who has that. But all in all, I'm really interested to know your thoughts about the survival boxes. If you think it's a great deal, a good deal, a decent deal, it's like, eh, it's okay. Definitely drop down in the comment section and let me know what you guys feel about survival boxes. One really quick announcement that we want to make before we leave is we have our impending 50,000 subscriber giveaway where we're going to be giving away $5,000 worth of awesome gear and prizes. But what we're going to be doing with this particular gear only box is we're going to be putting that back into our savings account for the awesome gear we're gonna be giving away. So that's gonna be included. But that just about does it for now. If you like this unboxing the way we did this video, definitely throw this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to share this out with your friends and family and your social media networks so we can keep growing and thriving and making awesome videos for you guys. But that just about does it for now. I hope you guys have an absolute wonderful day. I'm out.